welcome to the review of Open Heavens Daily Devotional for 28th February 2024. Our topic today is called to be prayerful. So it's a good time to pray. Father, we bless your holy name and we thank you. Thank you because we are your children. Thank you because you made us in your own image. Thank you because you called us to yourself for many reasons, one of which is to be prayerful. We ask, oh God, that you teach us to be more prayerful in the name of Jesus. We ask that as we reveal today's devotional, let your word find place in our hearts and let our lives be changed in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. We give you all the praise. In Jesus' mighty name we've prayed. Amen. Praise the Lord. Our Bible text is taken from Luke chapter 18 from verse 1 to 8 and it speaks of the parable of a persistent widow who was approaching a wicked judge for help. And we see if we look up from verse 5, Luke chapter 18 from verse 5, the Bible says, Yet, because this widow troubles me, I will avenge her, lest by her continual coming she weary me. That was the judge talking. And verse 6, then the Lord said, Hear what the unjust judge said. And shall God not avenge his own elect who cry out day and night to him, though he bears long with them? Verse 18, the last verse. I tell you that he will avenge them speedily. Nevertheless, when the Son of Man comes, will he really find faith? on the earth praise god so we see in today's bible scripture in today's reading jesus christ was actually telling his disciples that god hears if that wicked judge because the woman kept coming over and over and over could have considered the woman then certainly when we speak to our god when we call to him frequently often consistently continually he will hear us. Praise God. Our memory verse is from 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 17, and it says, Pray without ceasing. Pray without ceasing. Meaning we must pray continually. We wake up, we we'll pray. We're about to go to bed, we we'll pray. We're visiting friends, we we'll pray. We're living there, we we'll pray. Every single moment of our lives, we should be praying because we are called to a life of prayer praise the lord as ministers of god we shouldn't be people who just tell people to pray or lead them to pray without actually praying ourselves when we're giving prayer points to people then it's a good time for us ourselves to also take time within that moment to pray not to just tell people pray about this pray about that motivate people to pray and we ourselves are not doing the same i pray that god will help us in the name of jesus now did you share the story that he had shared before in today's devotional about how in the early 80s he visited south korea and he was introduced to the prayer grottos of pastor yongi cho's church where he spent time praying praying for the growth of the redeemed christian church of god that's at that time and then he you know he shared how after praying by the time he got out you know people were upset and angry everybody had left the bus that took him there had other passengers who were upset and wanted to know why that the Jew was praying for so long and all of that well you can't pray everything in one day and all but god answered that prayer because he prayed long and of course i prayed in other times and in other situations as well and many years after when he visited south korea again he met with pastor young cho who now said please pray for me and this is how god can elevate someone who is consistently praying our key point today says i don't know where god is taking you but if you really want to get there then you must lead a prayerful life i want to encourage you to spend time praying as after listening to this review pray in every situation you find yourself pray take time to pray every single day pray about the work of god on your hands if you don't know it yet pray about it tell god to reveal it to you whatever he reveals pray for strength pray for grace 
pray for help pray for your family pray for your nation pray for your mind pray for your children pray for your neighbors pray for any single thing that comes to your mind never stop praying remember a memory verse for today first Thessalonians chapter 5 verse 17 pray without ceasing god bless you